Hope everyone has had a uh, good day today. I know I have. Another day in the books, CDL training uh, with Maverick Transportation on the campus of Arkansas State University in Newport, Arkansas. What happened today? Well, we done a um, road trip this morning. Uh, me and another student went out with uh, Dale, who is one of the instructors there. And um, good drive, um, good drive. Um, Dale's actually got a newer truck. Um, I think I talked about that the other day. And uh, shift pattern on it's pretty tight but i i like it um better than some of those trucks that's wore out pretty good uh and i mean nothing wrong with the equipment just you know i guess the the shift pattern on them has been used so much that it's you know feels like there's a lot more room for error you might say anyway uh, i drove up to batesville um i don't know probably 30 35 miles from newport and this morning, and then uh, the other student drove us back um, to Newport. And then when we got into town there at Newport, um, we started going through the actual road test um, that we will do next week. So they, they actually know the pattern of that road test. There, there's one of two ways you can go. So, And um, our instructor actually used to be a uh, third party tester um, here in Arkansas for commercial driver's license. So he actually had a uh, score sheet and um, tested us just like he would have several years ago when he was doing it. Um, we both passed. I, I think I got a 93 on mine. Um, I'm not real sure what the other guy made, but I, I did hear him say that he did pass. So I will take that, you know, uh, you, you, I guess basically you start out with 100% and then, you know, there's things you get marked off for. And uh, he didn't tell me what I got marked off for, but anyway, um, I'll, I'll take that 93. Hope I can get that next week with the actual tester. Um, and while I'm on that note, um, I'll also say um, yesterday, uh, Steve, uh, he's one of the instructors there as well. He's like the uh, assistant instructor, second command, I guess you might say on that commercial driver training. Uh, he graded us on our 90 degree alley dock and um, our straight line back and our offset back. And he did not give us any free pull ups or get outs. Um, so the state, with, with the state police, we'll get two free pull ups on the 90 and two get outs. We can get out of the truck and look twice. We also get that on the offset and in the straight line back, we get one free pull up and one get out and look. Uh, and basically what that means is we don't get any points uh, for those um, situations that, that we do there. Uh, I got a 94 on that yesterday, so I will take that as well, uh, which I th in my understanding, I would basically be at about 100% with the state police on, on the skills test. Um, I do want to back up to the day before yesterday because I, I posted the pre-trip uh, inspection that Steve done. I know the wind was a little um, bad that day and me using this phone, not real sure if there's anything I can do about that. I don't guess there is. Probably get a different camera uh, with like a wind buffer on the mic or something. But anyway, it's kind of off subject. Uh, that'd be a question for Craig Grind probably. Um, Anyway, day four yesterday, I went on the road with Dale also. Uh, major improvement on my part. I mean, that's that's what you're wanting. I feel like I even had major improvement today from day before yesterday. So that's a good thing. Uh, that's, that's what you're shooting for is improvement each and every time that you go out. Um, we came back uh, after the we done the testing today, uh, mock test, you might say. Went to lunch and then we went back out on the range and worked on our 90 degree um, straight line and the offset back like we have been for the last week or so. And uh, still some people struggling, um, still some people that need a little work there. And um, so, I mean, that's just that's just part of the game. Got to improve, got to get ready for next week because we will test. 
And then this afternoon, Steve went down to the actual testing uh, area uh, when I done the facilities tour of the uh, university up there. I kind of pointed that out so you can go back and look at that video. Um, <clears throat> so he went down with a truck and actually showed us, you know, his setup, procedure, and everything. You know, and I, I y'all have heard me say this several times. He gives you all those instructions, gives us the instructions. He'll give you the instructions when you get there and get into that 90 degree alley dock and also the offset. And if you will follow those step by step, you get your setup right and you follow those step by step, it's going to put you in there because that's what he done today. I mean, as simple as I know to put it. So uh, I, I got some video of that, but it's horrible. The wind was, was gusting pretty bad today and I just can't, I can't put it up. Um, it, it's pretty bad. I don't know if I'll be able to get it again. I don't know if he's going to do it again Monday or something. We got class tomorrow as well, Saturday. But um, if somebody goes down there and does that, I'll try to get some better footage maybe with the wind not blowing. Uh, but anyway, that's that's where we're at as of right now. Um, excited. Um, ready to get down to Maverick next week and um, start my securement training. Hopefully uh, get with a trainer. You know, I've been home for four weeks. A lot of these guys are going home after securement training, um, I'm kind of hoping when I get down there, I can kind of talk to them and maybe I'll go ahead and get with a trainer. Uh, Cause like I said, I've been home uh, this whole time during this uh, CDL training. Hey, uh, you thinking about going to Maverick Transportation? Um, shoot me an email, give me your name, uh, phone number. I'll have a recruiter get in touch with you or you can get in touch with them. Just give them my name, Neil. N-E-I-L, and then my last name is Otts, and the spelling on that is O-T-T-S. Um, you've already been in contact with them. Like I said, give them my name. Um, also, you thinking about getting a CDL here in Arkansas? You ought to consider uh, this university up at Newport, Arkansas State University. Uh, get in touch with them. Uh, get on the website there, find that commercial driver training and, and uh, link there, and, and they got a phone number you can contact. Uh, get a hold of Bobby Joe up there, and, and uh, I'm telling you, I, I would. I'm, I'm so glad that I, I went that way. Um, I, I'm, I just really am. Uh, I feel confident, and um, feel like that I, I know what I'm doing to uh, the best of my ability at this point. And I, you know, I think I'm pretty confident about the pre-trip, uh, the skills, and, and the road. And uh, you know, that's what you want. Now, I wouldn't have that uh, if I had not chose to come here. Hey, y'all have a good day, and uh, I'll probably post another video tomorrow.